What's up guys, Fizz Zono here and welcome back to another Minecraft video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to use Chunk Base once again. Though, this version is updated since Minecraft has updated quite a bit since I did my last video. Have you ever been lost at sea trying to find the stronghold? Even though you have all the eyes of ender you need, you just can't find it? Well then, this video is the exact video for you. So, the first step in finding all these places like the stronghold, rune portal, villages, blah blah blah, slime chunks, so on and so forth, is chunk base. How to get onto chunk base is you go on Google and search up chunkbase.com. I'll meet you right there. So here you will be at chunkbase.com. Now what you want to do is you want to go to apps and now here you can see all the different chunk finders. So there are the popular, which is biome, slime chunk, village, overworld, nether, and end. So you can search for any of these by just clicking on them. I'm going to look for a shipwreck. So, now you want to go back to Minecraft and go into the game and type slash seed. Or if you're in survival and you're in a multiplayer world, just ask your host for the seed. Okay, so as you can see here, my seed is this. It's too long to remember, so you can just copy it to clipboard. Now once you've copied it, you want to go back to chunk base. Here, you can put your seed in right here, put your version of Minecraft that you have, and it should load your whole map. These are all the shipwreck spawn locations in the world I'm currently in. Now, you wanna go back to Minecraft to find your exact coordinates. So I don't know the exact functions of every version in Minecraft, but I know in Java, when you're on a PC or something, all you have to click is F3. That's, that's what I click usually, and that's what you should click if you don't have any changes in your key settings. So, um, at, like, it says X, Y, and Z in the second paragraph at the top. So, uh, yeah, those are your coordinates. You don't have to do your Y coordinate because it's not really going to matter much. You just have to need your, you just have to know your X coordinate and Y coordinate. Okay, so I haven't memorized my exact coordinates, but I, but I know it's about that. And I can see that the closest shipwreck to me is right here at coordinates 4752 negative one four seven five i can teleport there and there should be a shipwreck but make sure that your version is correct and your seed is correct and you've put in your coordinates this can make it so that your your spawn locations are exactly correct and you're going to the closest one possible okay so now you can travel to the place of the shipwreck or like me since i'm in creative i can just do slash tp four seven five two and I don't really care about the uh, Y axis, so I'm just gonna put a squiggly line thingy and then negative one, four, seven, five. I believe that is the coordinates and it should be if I hit enter. And when we hit enter, are we near a shipwreck? Yes, we are. In fact, we're right next to one. So I didn't do the exact coordinates, but I did the approximate coordinates and we got right to the shipwreck. Now, of course you can travel, but uh, it takes quite a bit of time. So yeah, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and that it helped you. If it did, make sure to subscribe, hit the notifications bell and leave a like on this video. Anyways, thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Good bye.